It took five years after making a five minute choice. How you doing? My name is Jabari McLennan and I'm the founder of this question, What's Your Self Talk? And that question I use to challenge you to grow, to make it make you more aware of how you need to grow. All right, so I wanted to come to you and talk to you about something specifically this morning. It took me five minutes to make a choice. And I got to the point where I was a sophomore in high school. And I've faced so much adversity. I've uh, moved back and back from city to city. I've seen my parents argue. I've seen them be divorced. I've seen so many uh, different things that's in my neighborhood, whether it was friends or was family members, uh, just lose themselves to the streets. And it got to a point where I just said, I want a better life for myself and the future me. And when you get to that pain point and you just make a decision, and that decision is solely based off of everything you're seeing around you, and you start saying, I don't want these results, that's what I did. So I went to my mom. I said, you know what, mama? You don't ever have to worry about paying for me to go to school. I'm going to earn my way. I'm going to get there by myself. Because to be honest with you, we didn't have the money to be able to get there. And I knew she did in as well. And so at that point, guess what I did? I went to work. I went to work. Three years later, after that decision that I made, I wasn't where I wanted to be. Even that, at that point, I had to make even harder decisions. Do I keep going? Do I persevere? It's going to be your question today. How do you persevere? So what did I do? I had to keep going. As you start looking back, it's one thing that I tell myself today is I don't have any other choice. I have to keep going. I have to keep moving forward. And you you may be there. So guess what? Two more years passed. And after those two years, Mm -hmm. I start understanding I need to get around better people. I need to start putting better information in my mind. And I need to start talking and processing my thoughts with the people who understand where I came from and who maybe came from where I came from or maybe even worse but did not allow that to determine where they can go. And after that point, after five years of telling my mom, five minutes, because realizing I didn't want those results. Five years, I got to my goal. I've accomplished my goal. And so I want to ask you, where are you at in that journey? You may made a decision within five minutes. Maybe you took a little bit longer. Maybe it was at the beginning of this year, you said you were going to do something. Maybe it was a year ago, you said you were going to do something. Maybe you hit that three-year mark, and you're like, man, I don't know if I still want to do this. Or maybe you're close, and you don't, here's the thing, sometimes you just don't know where you're at in that journey. That's why it is so important to persevere. So how are you choosing to persevere? How are you choosing to put the right people in front of you or around you so that you can process the right information that's going to push you to move forward? Because chances are, it's going to be people around you who's going to be negative, who's going to have the victim mentality, and you're going to have to say no to them. And saying no to the loved ones sometimes is a good thing because when they see that you're serious, when they see you keep pushing, when they see you keep moving forward, they don't be like, okay, no, she's serious. He's serious. But even more important, do it for yourself because when you are confident, And what you say, and if you're going to persevere and make it happen, then guess what? Others take you seriously as well. So I want you to go throughout the day and ask yourself the question, how will I persevere today? What was my five-minute moment? Was that just yesterday? Was that a few months ago? Was that last year when that thing happened and you're like, I'm done, I'm, I'm finished? Was that a year ago? Was that two years ago? Regardless of when that was, I want you to go back to that moment and ask yourself, Why did I make this choice? And do I want the results of me not moving forward? And then keep pressing. Keep moving. And know that I am with you. And everybody in this community is as well. All right? Thank you for watching. And you know that question I'm going to always ask you. 